Hey guys, welcome back for another video. I'm excited today. <laughs> I went to Sally Beauty. Uh huh. And picked up four gels, all by Care Care. Uh huh. Four. Cuatro. Um, they were four ninety nine. I was really interested in the Stronghold gel. Oh wait, hold up. I mind. First, they say that's the first thing to go. If you are new here, first off, welcome. Rain Gang, welcome back, sis, for another video. I appreciate you guys for stopping by. My name is Raina, okay? Anywho, so what interests me was the Super Hold Gel. Y'all know I love me a good Super Hold. Flake free. It says, gives a strong hold, period. <laughs> Straight to the point. That's that's how I am, okay? You know? Um, well. <laughs> flake free, no parabens, mineral oil, silicones, phthalates, or petroleum. And then I had saw the Strengthening Gel. Uh-huh. Extra virgin olive oil. And I was like, I'm all what? Strengthens and conditions hair while giving a good hold. Everything says, like, giving a good hold. Mm-hmm. Second ingredient, though, is glycerin. Oh, second ingredient is glycerin too. Mm, this is gonna be fun. Um, second ingredient, glycerin. All right, cool. This is the moisturizing gel with Jamaican black castor oil. That makes sense to have glycerin as a second ingredient, huh? Last but not least, the anti-shedding with biotin for natural and relaxed hair. Okay, second ingredient, glycerin. Eh, helps reduce shedding while getting a good hold. <laughs> Care care straight to the point. I just I'm just gonna do all four. Like, you know, four sections of my hair, and we're just gonna test it out. So, anywho, y'all, oh, I gave myself a little cut. Mm-hmm. I did. But I mean, I don't know if you can really, really tell, but my hair is like shorter, right? If you are new here, I do not use any leave-ins when trying new products. A lot of times I typically will skip leave-ins. My moisture routine is pretty, pretty decent. I find that leave-ins really aren't like essential for me. They're good to do, but they're not. Not essential for me but do whatever works for you and your hair now i'm excited four gels on one head wow fancy okay i'm mainly interested in the stronghold gel i hate when i can't describe a smell i don't know y'all it's it's faint feminine oh it's thick y'all this is so thick oh god let me like this G. This is for natural. I think they're all for natural and relaxed hair. So great for that's awesome. <laughs> Let me not get excited. Cause I get excited. I get my little feelings hurt and take it. Okay. So immediately the application is very nice for it to be thick. It really glides on the hair. Like it's a thinner gel. Go ahead and subsection. I'm just going to take a little bit more. I was always complaining about my dog on ends and I was just got tired. I was like, let me, and my shape was just real unshaped like, you know, and I'm a shapely woman. Ooh. Off the bat, it's not weighing my hair down like extremely, but it's, you know, it's decent enough. And it did coat all of my strands. As you can see, like it's very gel-like. My strands are very coated. They're clumping together. No frizz really. So honestly, I'm about the application, how it's gonna look when it dries. It says flake free, so I feel like I can build this up. Now, my toxic trait is the fact that I don't really watch YouTube, like I said before in other videos. And so I get so excited, I don't think to like, Google or look up another review. So I'm sure this is old. I'm sure it is. Um, and I'm sure you probably have already tried it, but I haven't. <laughs> Ooh, tough crowd. Um, so when I subsectioned, it seemed very promising, but it's already starting to like swell. And that lets me further know this might not be the gel for me. But listen, as long as I've been doing this, you never know, fam, until it dries. And so this is how this section is looking. Nice and shiny, coated. I'm here for it. I'm, I'm here for it so far. So we're gonna go ahead and put the Stronghold Gel away. Let's try the moisturizing gel. If you don't know, I don't like soaking wet curls to do my wash and go. That is, you know, what people like to do. But for me, that does not work for me. For my hair to be like wet, but dampish. So this has no smell. I don't smell anything. Okay, so the consistency is still very thick with a sl slight difference off the bat. Hmm, this is giving like all these gels are gonna be the same. <laughs> That's what it's giving. Okay, well, anyway, off the bat, the application is exactly the same as the Stronghold Gel. Um, I'm not wowed because it's really not weighing my hair down, as you can see. I even subsection. 
I don't know, I'm not wowed. It gives like it's not going to hold my hair. And I know you probably can't tell, but it's not giving like, oh my gosh, it's that glycerin. It's that glycerin. I know it's the glycerin. Anyway, let's finish this um, section. So I've been using my pattern brush, smooth and detangle further and kind of clump my curls. I mean, it's really shiny, right? But it's really not grabbing hold to the product like a wet line would do. If I was in the store and I had the option to choose either or, I would definitely not choose no strong, I mean no moisturizing gel. Cause I can moisturize myself, uh-huh. We can lotion up and all down as much as I need to. I don't need, I need the gel to hold. I need the gel to hold. So far, I mean, these are one of those things that I'm really not gonna know what it's looking like until it dries. All right, cool. So now we are done with the moisturizing gel. Moving on. Yes, let's try the anti-shedding gel. I don't see how I'm gonna be able to like really determine if this really, really works. The thing is, it says it gives a good hold. So I guess we're gonna, I don't know, child. We are gonna go ahead and, uh-huh, Biotin's the fourth one. So man, ain't that much Biotin. Okay, no really good, you know what I feel like they did? Y'all, it's the same consistency. It's. Did I get got? I may have. It's the same consistency. There's just the colors are different. Ain't no difference. This is funny. I wonder they was $4.99 each. Hmm. Okay. We not gonna judge. My name is not Jesus Jr. The anti-shedding with biotin. Consistency is the same. I mean, Tia Tamara over here. Mary Kay Nashville. That's okay. That's okay. It's $4.99, right now. $4.99. But again, the ingredients really aren't the best. I mean, wet line, all them things really ain't the best. You know what I mean? The application is the exact same. So this is how my hair is looking. I like how it's gliding on. It's not giving like a huge weight. So look, this is what I mean. This is what Eco and Wetline do. They, it like almost straightens out. It gives heat damage. That's what I like. And I remember I said that one time, somebody took it the wrong way. My hair is not heat damaged. It, it gives heat damage as meaning that it, it, uh, it straightens it out. And that's what I look for. My, the other side didn't do that. So far, the blue looks like it's doing something. I'm not really sure. That's really, really pretty. That's really pretty. The blue gel is blue gelling. So we did the anti-shedding of the with the biotin on this section just now. Last but certainly not least is the strengthening gel with extra virgin olive oil. If you watch me often and see me do my hair, you know that this side of my hair is just trifling, okay? She looks damaged. She's not. She's not, my hair has always been like this since a little girl. Um, this side is definitely a lot looser and not as dense. <laughs> this all the same, oh no, this is a little different. Okay, so there is some difference, but okay, cool. So this is, yeah, it's about as thick as it will be. They're the same, okay, She's, they're all thick. Application is the same. Look at that. Ooh, that's what a good cut would do. My hair don't be doing that when it's just in need of a trim, uh-huh. First of all, let me close this. This is for the strengthening gel, which we just did on this side. You know, I didn't have high hopes like Jasmine Sullivan for this. I hope for us, baby. Uh-huh. My forehead's out here being a little shy, so let me give her some company. My Shanti. Currently, my hands are sticky. Uh-huh, maybe in like 30 minutes to an hour to see what we're looking like. And then we're gonna go ahead and diffuse. So in the meantime, in between time, I'll go ahead and pray. Because, um. So far, everything feels the exact I'm really same. trying to count the 10, let me breathe. Gonna go ahead and try it, uh-huh. Take my pattern blow draw. It was all a lie. Um, so first of all, you can really tell how much I cut off my hair because I have not stretched it yet. Obviously some parts, I just, the glycerin is showing out. Stronghold. <laughs> I don't know where it is. Is it just, I don't know. We gonna go ahead and stretch. Currently my hair is extremely soft, not, not an ounce. 
of any type of hold. Anyway, I'm gonna change the nozzle. I'm just trying to figure out where was the stronghold. On, it says on the package, stronghold. <laughs> This is the stronghold side, and when I, it's so pillow soft. I just, I just, <laughs> hold on, let me, <laughs> I'm gonna take the Edge Fixer by Kiss. I don't know if y'all know, but I love the Edge Fixer. All right, so, I mean, Honestly, my hair looks good. Hands are extremely sticky. My hair, it looks good, but I don't like it. I don't like any of the gels. No, I don't. They all feel the same. So I feel like, how we, how will you know? The moisturizing doesn't feel any different from the stronghold. They feel exactly the same. <laughs> I think the glycerin is so overpowering in all of them. So this is one of those things where like, it looks good, you know? But the feel of it, it feels like extremely glycerin-like. Um, if you like that feeling, you'll love these. Okay. I will say this, because I try to be fair, even if I don't like something. I feel like if you love glycerin, you will love these. I feel like none of these claims, stronghold wear, huh? Stronghold, where was it? Let me know because all of them, like I said, it feels like I used one gel. Anywho, I'm just, I don't like them. Uh, for me, you know, again, you when no way. One person reviewing the product and they may not like it or they may love it does not mean that it's a wonderful product and it does not mean that it's a terrible product. It's whatever works for you and your hair. So the price point is great. The accessibility is great. The selection is great. There's something for everybody. If I had to choose one, I would probably do the stronghold gel. It's not a strong, it's not a stronghold. If I had to choose, I would choose this one because I feel like this side of my hair has more and kept more definition than the biotin side is a little bit more frizz. I don't know, you guys really can't tell. So I'm gonna go ahead and just conclusion. If you like glycerin, buy these. I mean, I'm not gonna tell you what to do with your money, but if you're looking for a gel that's not gonna give you any type of hold that has glycerin, that's easy on the pockets, and that will pretty much hold your curls if your curls are similar to mine. But for me in my house, it's just not, it's not for me. Uh, I need to go wash my hands. It's driving me crazy. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. Um, you know, um, oh, you can return some, can't you? Mm. Have a blessed day, and um, I will see you on my next video. Love you guys.